Good afternoon, everyone. What a beautiful afternoon it is, too. This is camping weather. I love it. So I want to take you guys for a tour of this Montana 3791RD. The RD stands for rear den. This camper comes in at 14,240 pounds. It's 40 feet, 5 inches long, and it is awesome. So we'll start out with this side you're going to notice that you've got frameless windows mostly frame frameless windows can't talk looks really sharp you've got a nice big powered awning that does have led lights under it you have your outside speakers montanas are just gorgeous units and i'm going to take you for a little tour of look at the size of this under storage here pass-through storage massive you have TV hookup out here so you can put a TV out here and watch it. You also have your road vac out here. So what that does, you've got it inside too. You've got a hose and stuff you connect to, you sweep. You don't have to bring broom, dustpan, all that crap with you uh, when you're taking off camping. Having it outside like that's nice because you can keep your pass-through storage clean, but you can also do um, your tow vehicle if you wanted. From this side, I want to show you the command center area. So we've got our tank dumps here. We also have our tank flushes. And you can do all of your winterization from right here, which is super nice, including your battery disconnect and everything. You have your key TV hookup here. So this is where your main line comes in. Key TV is pretty cool. It's been out for a couple of years now. But basically, before key TV, when you hooked a cable connection up to your camper, you had to watch the same channel in, in the entirety of the camper. Now everybody can watch different channels, which is pretty cool. Show you a little bit on this side. Nothing super fancy to see. You do have a ton of storage in the back here because this is a rear den unit. I'll go ahead and pop this door open for you and show you. So you actually have this tray that will pack or that will slide out so you don't have to try to climb back in there. But I mean, you could easily fit a couple of kayaks in here. And as you see on both sides, you have access to that as well. Back here on the back, we have a ladder. So it is a fully walkable roof, making it super easy for cleaning and maintenance. You are backup camera, rear observation camera prepped. Literally, all you have to do is buy the camera, pop that bad boy in there and you're good to go. Let's go check out the inside. Solid steps, these are great. Make it nice and stable for getting in and out and they are adjustable if you're on une uneven terrain. Also wanna point out that the Montanas are four season living. So if you're looking for a full-time camper, this would be it. It is a 2021, so it does have this updated uh, interior color which looks extremely nice. I think you'll find it. It looks great. We'll start up here in the bedroom. So we've got our king size bed that does feature storage underneath it. Massive closet. And you even have a laundry hamper. Then you also have this closet. Those chairs go with your freestanding dinette that I'll show you in the kitchen. But back behind there, you have a connector so you can have washer dryer in here. We're talking about full time living and stuff. You'll notice too, there is no AC unit here. That's because this is the quiet cool system. So the AC units are actually up on top of the unit. Directly across from the bed, we've got a bank of drawers and we've got our framed in TV, something Montana does that I think just kind of adds a more complete finished look. Sliding barn door. Our bathroom, so we have our toilet, of course. We've got a little cabinet here. It's actually really deep. I shouldn't call it little. But you can keep whatever in there. Sit-down shower with ample height room in it. Nice kitchen sink with plenty, or bathroom sink with a lot of countertop space. And you do have some cabinets and a drawer below as well as a cabinet here since you don't have a medicine cabinet. Coming out into the unit. Uh, you'll see right as we came in, we have a place to hook your jackets or dog leashes or whatever, your car keys and some honeydew list, whatever you need there. We have that freestanding dinette that I was talking about, and it does have some cool features like you have the extendable uh, leaf right there. And then something else I really like is these little guys. So you've got regular power and USB power, lots of windows. 
Uh, one of the other things that Montana's all feature is right now I have like the sunshade down. So you're still letting light in here, but it's kind of helped keep it cooler. But all the windows do have the full blackout shades too. So if you want privacy or whatever, we'll do the kitchen last when I come back around. So this is the rear den. Feels very residential. You'll notice that we've got two full-size couches on each side. Those do fold out into beds. We've got our theater seats here. Those do recline. They have heat and massage. Then that all basically faces our entertainment area. So we've got our giant electric fireplace down there. And I always like to point out that that is an electric fireplace. So you're not using your propane, but you could definitely take the chill out of the air, make it nice and comfortable in here. You have your telescopic TV that's in its down position right now. So if you have something beautiful to look at during the day, you can put that at night. You can uh, run your TV up and watch TV. Cabinets on both sides. And then back behind the little black glass there is your CD, DVD player and your inside speakers. And they do that black glass because your remote will work through it. You don't have to have that folded down, which is nice. You do also have a curtain to separate that off. So you can have like movie night up here, black out all the shades, watch a cool, scary movie. I don't know. Our kitchen area. So you'll notice we've got a freestanding uh, island with like an 80-20 stainless steel sink with detachable sprayer. We've got quite a bit of cabinetry over here with a residential size stainless steel microwave, three burner stainless steel stove. We have drawers below our uh, island. We have a little breakfast nook area over there, again, with more storage. Residential-sized refrigerator. Massive, massive refrigerator. And, as if all those drawers weren't enough, you do actually have a really deep pantry right here for more storage. And again, talking about that new look and feel, how they have went lighter, brighter, but they've also added some darker accent areas to kind of help balance it out. Should also point out, no carpet in this slide. That's like that indoor-outdoor woven material. I have it in my Cougar. Super easy to clean. So guys, there you have it. If you have any questions, comments, oh, you're going to say, Dan, you didn't tell us the price. That is because due to manufacturer's restrictions, we actually have a lower than MSRP price on these now. So we can't advertise the price directly in the videos or on our website. You can do two things, one of two things. You can either message us on here and we can reply to you with the price. Or if you're on the website and you see a unit that says click for special pricing, that's one of those units. And if you click that button, you can put in your email address and we can send you that information. So guys, as always, thank you for watching. If there's a specific unit you would like to see, just leave a comment down below and Greer and I would be happy to go shoot it for you. Have a great day.